Hey guys, how's it going? I hope you're having a very good day. So I'm here to do a tag video for you. I'm actually gonna divide it into two parts. This first part is going to be kind of a neutral book tag video and the second part will be a holiday themed book tag. So let's get started with this first part. I'm going to be doing the confessions of a booktuber tag and this was created by Keegan from Secretly Siblings and Meliza from Bookishly Meliza co-created this tag along with him. I was also tagged by Abigail from Smile Right Live. So thank Thank you Abigail for that tag. So on to the questions. The first one is what camera and editing software do you use? For my camera I use a Canon 60D. To edit the footage I use Final Cut Express and for everything else the animation and the different special effects I use After Effects. The second question is how many hours do you spend filming and editing your videos? For less than 10 minute video I usually take between 15 to 30 minutes to record and if it's a longer video I take up to an hour which is pretty great. Crazy. And as far as editing my videos, I take at least three hours. So it does take a while to edit the footage and add all the special specialness to it. Third question is, do you film your videos in one take or does it take multiple tries? For me, I take multiple takes in one try. Sometimes if I feel like I'm rambling on and on again and I feel like it's going to be a horror to edit, I re-record it because I just can't, you know. The fourth question is, when is it easiest for you to film? And it's easiest for me right after work, especially when no one's around that's always good the fifth question is something awkward you do while you record and you guys probably know my awkwardness better than I do you know I often stutter during my videos I also look to the side when I'm thinking when I'm coming up with an answer because usually these videos are on the fly um, lots of ums and ands and dead silences so that's always fun. Number six is one quote from a book that you love. So I have a couple. These two quotes are from A Tree Grows in Brooklyn by Betty Smith. It was a good thing that she got herself into this other school. It showed her that there were other worlds beside the world that she had been born into and that these worlds were not unattainable. The other quote that I absolutely adore People always think that happiness is a faraway thing, something complicated and hard to get. Yet what little things can make it up? A place of shelter when it rains, a cup of strong coffee when you're blue. For a man, a cigarette for contentment, a book to read when you're alone, just to be with someone you love. Those things make happiness. I love those quotes a whole lot. The seventh question is, what video are you most proud of? For me, I'm really proud of my Battle of the Books videos. My first year I did it, I did Vampires vs. Werewolves, and last year I did Zombies vs. Unicorns. And those videos I kind of plan out ahead and just put more effort into them than I usually do with other videos. And just editing them was just hilariously fun, so that was all well and good. I also adore my quotables video, the one I did for The Fault in Our Stars, by John Green. Question number eight is how long does it take you to get ready for a video? Usually five to ten minutes long because I'm not really a beauty person. I try my best. I appreciate those who comment on the hair and the makeup and things but yeah it takes me a while to figure out what to do with this thing so I'm ready to chop it off sooner or later it's going to happen. Question number nine is what was the last booktube video that you watched? The last video I watched was by Camilla from The Artsy Girl 12. I watched her book pet peeves video which was awesome. Definitely check her out guys. I will leave a link to that video as well as her channel down below. Question number 10 is what is your favorite booktube video of all time? For me I don't have any specific videos that come to mind but I love when I see collab videos. I remember watching Melissa and Eric do a review video together. I also love watching Stacy and Jessica from the Chapter Chicks do videos together. Just when there's two people in the same room talking and having a good time. It's always fun to watch. They're so hilarious and fun. Question number 11 is what one book that you hated that everyone else liked? Hate is such a strong word, but if I had to choose one that I disliked or was unenthused about, it would be Breaking Dawn by Stephanie Meyer. Mm-hmm. It's just weird. Question number 12 is who are your booktube friends? And I've met so many people since I've started and I adore them so. For this tag specifically, I do have to mention the people that I met when I first started, my booktube beginnings, if you will. Some of them that I do mention are still here with us, which I'm very, very glad about. Do not leave me. But for the majority of people that I've met when I first started, I don't know where they went. I miss them a whole lot and I hope that they return someday, one day. The first person 
I do want to mention is Megan from Megan the Book Addict, Melissa from Melissa's Books, Leanne from Leanne J.C. Ray, Dylan from DM Friend 26, Bex from Weasley is My King 09, Renee from Nahome is 2, Brayden from Book Probe, as well as Claudia from Mrs. Book Lover, my first Australian booktuber friend. I miss Claudia so much. I don't know where you are, Claudia, but we miss you. David from DP Book Reviews, Liz from Illizzy Books, Sonia from Sonia the Book Lover, Camilla from The Artsy Gal 12, Rima from The Reading Rhino Press, Amber from Books of Amber, Brittany and Farrah from I Eat Words, Stacey and Jessica from Chapter Chicks, Danny from Danny Marks YA, Kaiser from Maxi Magics, Sydney from The Lit Kid, Krista from The Cubicle Blindness, Karen from OCD of Books, Stars from Stars Books, Bunny from Bunny Kate, Morgan from Lexi Vamp 666, Jack from Reading with Jack, and of course Caitlin from Xmas Book Obsessed. I adore these people, I adore their videos a lot. And the last question is, what booktuber or YouTuber would you die if they subscribe to you? I only found this out recently ago, maybe a month or two ago. I didn't know you could see who subscribed to you by clicking on your subscriber count on your homepage. So I clicked on that and while I was browsing, I saw that Ingrid from Miss Glamorazzi had subscribed to me. And so I just kind of died a little bit when I saw that. Hi Ingrid, how's it going? Thanks for subscribing. I appreciate everyone who subscribes to me and I die a little bit every day when more and more people watch, but you know, that's just me. All right, so that is the confessions of a booktuber tag. Next guys, I'm going to be doing the infinite book challenge tag as well as the rainbow spines tag. I was tagged by Susie from Read Susie Read and this tag was created by Arsatine Reads. I hope I said that correctly. So basically the rules our name as many books as you can in one minute so uh, here we go Harry Potter and the Philosopher's Stone um, Chamber of Secrets Prisoner of Azkaban, Goblet of Fire, Order of the Phoenix, Half-Blood Prince, um, Deathly Hallows, we have um, Game of uh, Game of Thrones, Clash of Kings, A Storm of Swords, Feast of Crows, Dance of Dragons, Looking for Alaska, The Fault in Our Stars, and Abundance of Catherines. Um, there is Paper Towns, and we have what else do we have? We have Monsters of Men, uh, Asking the Answer, uh, The Knife of <laughs> the, uh, the Knife of Never Letting Go. What else? There is also um, Gone, Hunger, Fear. Yes, The Hunger Games, Catching Fire, Mocking Jay. Uh, we have The Monstrumologist, we have The Isle of Blood, um, Curse of the Wendigo. There is Twilight, New Moon, Eclipse, Breaking Dawn. We also have The Lightning Thief. That went faster, way faster than I thought. Next guys, I'm going to do the Rainbow Spines tag. You choose books with the spines of the specific colors of the rainbow. So our first color is red, and I chose Dash and Lily's Book of Dares by Rachel Cohn and David Levithan. For orange, I chose The Curious Incident of the Dog in the Nighttime by Mark Haddon. For yellow, I chose The Girl with the Dragon Tattoo by Stiga Larson. For green, I thought it was fitting to choose The Emerald Atlas by John Stevens. For blue, I chose Beauty Queens by Libra for Indigo, I chose The Titan's Curse by Rick Riordan. And lastly, guys, for Purple, I chose Geek Girls Unite, and this is by Leslie Simon. That's my Rainbow Spines tag. I hope the color editing won't look crappy with this because this is pretty cool. I'll have to put up a photo on my Tumblr just to show you guys what the true color looks like, but yep, that's that. Anyways guys, that is the first part of my tag video, neutral book tags. I will tag people in my pants below, so definitely go check that out. And if you would like to do this tag, definitely do so. Anyways guys, I will see you in part two. Have a good one. Bye.